later in this video. So where we can not even understand that you think you are the man and so you're gonna go work your plan. We said wham, we can not even understand that you think you are the man and so you're gonna go work your plan. Previously on the Super Pops, I miss Peyton. I know, but at least she's getting to spend some quality time with her parents back in Vandalia. We need to get the gang back together and get the bunglers back to being bad. I have some good news. I think it's about time you ladies take magical classes in Avalonia. It's a TikTok video. I will be a bungler again. Welcome to magic opt class, ladies. What makes this art class magical? Anything you paint will come to life. I think it's outside. <laughs> Finley, you drew a dragon? We need to get that dragon here to Earth. It looks like a portal to planet Earth. It's Harmony Sparkle. Shadow King, make these bunglers pure evil again. Super, Super Pops, Pops, we can't be so! Sorry, Super Pops. I guess my magic here on Earth is greater. What are we gonna do with the dragon is flying right towards the portal? Wait, what if we stop him using our new tools? They brought him here. They can probably stop him. Dragons love treasure. It's in all the dragon fairy tales I've ever read. <gasps> hey, dragon. Hi. It's me, Cosmic. Um, hey, look at that treasure over there. Super shiny, right? No! Dragon, come back here! Cosmic, you did it! There. Phew. Great job, ladies. Bunglers, what do we want? Total world domination! <laughs> <laughs> it's great being here at Baywood and all and having a lot of fun, but I can't wait to go back to Avalonia for magic classes. Same. Peyton is gonna love it when she gets back from Vendalia. I can't wait to show her the magic paintbrushes. What's wrong, Chloe? Oh, it's no biggie. It's just Spike and I were supposed to have a date last night and then he canceled and now he's not responding to me. I'm sure it's fine. I mean, I was actually gonna hang out with Cheshire, but... Oh! oh. <gasps> like a date? No. I don't... I don't know. It's okay, we all totally know that you like him. We stand this immortal fairy super pop romance. Yeah, we totally ship you guys. <sighs> okay, you guys, well, I don't know. We were supposed to hang out and I didn't hear from him. So we'll see. <gasps> we better get to class. Let's give Majesty the full version after. I was only able to give her the Cliff Notes version. Nice work, Siphony. We're regaining our army. Um, hello? I helped. He means both of us? You're an extension of me? You three will turn the Super Pops into bunglers. Then we will truly have total world domination. What do you want us to do? Harmony and I made these. Get each one of the Super Pops to wear this. It will turn them bad for good. Excellent. We'll do it. Perfect. We'll see you back here in a few. Slow down! One day at a time! What happened? There was a dragon! And magic art paintbrushes. And we stopped Siphony's plan. And your mama is just so sweet. Sorry, I got Southern again. Thank you, Cosmic. Is she all right? Was the dragon content? Yes, Majesty. All is well in Avalonia, and we're so ready for our next class. Thank goodness. I was worried because, well, I haven't heard from Cheshire in a while. Or Prospero, for that matter, as well. Strange. I feel like all the guys have gone missing today. Did I hear my name? Cheshire, we've been wondering where you were. Oh, Majesty, how silly of you. To worry about me? I'm a man. I could take care of myself. 
I know you can take care of yourself, but I'm your sister. I was worried. And what are you wearing? Oh, you like it? Anyway, I feel like being on this spaceship is just too much for you. I should take over. That way you could spend more time in your little library. Excuse me, little library? Cheshire, are you feeling okay? You're acting kind of weird. Yes, I would have to agree with Crystal. Crystal, you're looking quite stunning. And actually, I feel quite wonderful. Oh, oh, wow. Um, thank you. I'm so sorry I wasn't able to hang out last night. I had some business I had to take care of, but I would love to take you on a date right now. Oh, a date. <gasps> you, you're asking me on an official date? Um, yeah, I just did. Oh, wow. Okay, okay. Great. Let's go. Well, that was sweet, but very peculiar. I wonder what's gotten into him. Oh, you guys, Spike just texted me. He said that he was feeling sick before and that's why he canceled, but he's feeling a lot better now and wants to hang out. I'll see you guys later. Ugh, those girls and their boys. Tell me about it. Feels like forever since Power and James have been in Vandalia. I miss him. Well, you've got me, ladies. Majesty, you look wonderful. I've got tickets for a show tonight at the theater. And actually, I was thinking maybe we could grab a bite to eat beforehand. Oh, right. Um, sorry, ladies. I'll catch up with you later, okay? Is it just me, or is something up? I don't know. But let's talk about it over ice cream, okay? Wow, you're starting to sound like cosmic. Oh, wow, you set up a picnic for us? Um, yeah, yeah, I, I set this up for us. Hey, that's my picnic! Where am I? Picnic? Picnic? Wait, was this her? Oh, never mind that. Camilla, I wanted to give you this gift. Wow. This is so beautiful. So romantic. Well, hurry up, put it on. Oh, um, sorry, okay, um. The bunglers will have total world domination. Excellent. Hey, Cosmic, you're... Oh, oh my gosh, I'm still in pop mode. Oh, glad no one was around. What's up? Oh, nothing. I just wanted to give you a gift. Ah, you don't have to do that. Unless it's chocolate, I love chocolate. Oh, or flowers, I love pretty pink flowers. Oh, or a puppy. You know, Emma just got a puppy, and I wouldn't say no to a puppy. Uh, shh, 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 shh. You talk too much sometimes. Here. Oh, okay. Um. Oh my gosh, <gasps> Spike, this is beautiful. It's, it's perfect accessory for world domination. Exactly. Prospero, it doesn't look like there's a show tonight. Um, that's wrong. Jess, I've got a gift I'd like to give you. Oh, really? That's so kind. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Here you go. Oh, it's a necklace. It's a little darker than I'm used to wearing, but I like it. Go ahead, put it on. All right. The bunglers will have total world domination. It worked. Hello? Is anyone getting my text messages? Hey, you still haven't heard anything from them, have you? No, something is off, Finley. The guys were acting so weird and mean and like they were better than us. Which is weird, it's not like those guys at all. Exactly. Are they under a spell? And now Jess, Camilla, and Chloe are not responding to my text messages. I've got an idea. Now I'll just call Cheshire from an unknown number. Oh, don't forget Spike's voice. <coughs> Spike? Hey, Cheshire. What number are you calling from? A new one. I, uh, flush mine down the toilet. 
Typical Spike, am I right? Well, you better get everything figured out because we need to get with the girls and meet the Shadow King. Right. Because... Spike, have you already forgotten? You need to give Cosmic the cursed collar so then she turns bad. Then we turn the other Super Pops bad so they join the bunglers and then we get total world domination. Oh, right. Okay, of course. See you. We're all meeting on the spaceship, remember? Right, right. See you there. Oh my gosh, the nerve! We were right! This must be a bungler trap. Siphony. Um, yes and no. The real bad guy behind all of this is the Shadow King. He's the one that we saw when we turned Dr. Ruin good at Christmas time. He's the one we really need to take down. Oh, it's Majesty. You girls come to the spaceship. I have a surprise for you. Uh, something tells me it's a curse necklace. We've got to go in prepared. What are you looking for? The magic mirror. This may come in handy. Let's go. Super Pops, we can't be stopped! Ladies, so glad you could join us. I've never been to this part of the ship before. It's the observation deck. Ladies, we wanted to give you a gift. Oh, really? What is it? These cute necklaces, just like ours. Oh, cool. Um, thanks, but no thanks. What? You're turning down our gift? Yeah, we aren't really necklace people. They know. Quick, Chris will freeze them. We'll put the necklaces on them ourselves. Now, Electra, the mirror. <sighs> Whoa, what happened? And why are we dressed like this? You guys are all under a spell because your boyfriends are under a spell because the Shadow King put them all under a spell. They wanted us to all be bunglers. And speaking of which, I think they're coming. Quick, can I see those necklaces you were going to give us? Okay, these are deactivated. Flash, can you shapeshift us into those bad outfits that they're wearing? I've never shapeshifted other people before, or outfits, but I can try. Oh, wow. <laughs> Easier than I thought. Hey, that's cool. What's cool? Oh, just being a bungler. We love it. It's the best. Yeah! Total world domination! It's time to go meet with the Shadow King. Yes, he will be very pleased with our progress. <laughs> you know what? I'm just gonna say it. I am over this Shadow King. I'm over what he's done to you guys and his misogynistic attitude. That means thinking men are better than women. Wait, what? The spell, it's not working. Not on us, but you guys are still under a spell. We've got to break it. This isn't you, any of you. This is the Shadow King speaking through you. We have to use our voices to break this, ladies. This one goes out not just to you guys, but to you, Shadow King. Can you hear us? Look, if you girls can just be quiet, we can get you to the Shadow King. Let's do this. Super Pops, we can't be stopped.
going on? Ew! Why do we look like this? The Shadow King got to you all and turned you all into bunglers! Again. I'm so, so sorry. That's terrible! Thank you, Super Pops and Sister, for saving us. Every time you ladies always come through. You know, it's true what they say. You cannot be stopped. What do we do now? We have to get to the Shadow King and Siphony. Hopefully we can bring them down once and for all. We shouldn't let on yet, though, that the spell is broken. Let's catch him by surprise. Let's do this, guys. Super Pops, we, we can't, can't be stopped! stopped. <laughs> it was cool! I, I, don't, I don't know It was cool, was I thought it was good. Wow, oh, that was really good, you guys, but I can teleport us there. Yeah, I mean, oh, Matt, oh, you yeah, can do yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, we cool. don't Run, need yeah. to. <laughs> Where are those super pops? They should be here any minute. They texted us not that long ago. Ugh, where are they? Once they get here, we can finally set our plan into motion. With the super pops on our side, the whole world will finally bow down. Hello, Siphony. Majesty, super pops. How are you feeling? Oh, we're feeling mad. Excellent. The necklaces must have worked like a charm. Good job, boys. Thank you. There is just one thing we wanted to say, though. Actually, I think the Super Pops want to be the ones to say it. Oh, yeah. That's right. You know that whole world domination thing? Yes. Oh, yeah, but... There's one little thing you forgot. We're the Super Pops. and you're done. No! Harmony, this is all your fault. What? You're just looking for someone to blame. What did you do now? There's too much magic. This thing is about to collapse. I'll get us out of here, you guys. Oh, we got out just in the nick of time. Look! Wait, you teleported us out? Of course. Siphony, we know you're a bungler, but deep down, you have a heart. And even though you're not nice, we would save you time and time again. Because that's what heroes do. We will fight for you to be good. We know you have it in you. Aw, that makes me so <clears throat> sick. Let's get out of here, Harmony. And go where? Layers are a dime a dozen. That place was a shack anyway. See you next time, Pops. Great job, you guys. I mean, ladies. You ladies truly are heroes. You're the best. Thank you. We couldn't have done it without you as well. We're a team, just like we said in the song. So, do you guys want to say it with us? Yes! yes. Super Pops, we Perfect! <laughs> Miss Vulture, your sister is a genius! Don't you mean genius? I mean what I say, and I say what I mean. Now, to use Majesty's wand to restore my powers to their true potential! <laughs> <laughs> From now on, I am no longer Dr. Kittens. Call me Dr. Ruin. And you two will be more powerful than ever. Whoa, crazy. Whoa, I feel magical already. 
Now, follow me. It's time to tell the other bunglers of our success. Prospero and Disruptor will be pleased. But before that, it's time to take over Majesty's ship. <laughs> Let's go. Okay, we have to think. She may have taken our powers, but she did not take our intellect. True. If this is an exact replica of your dorm room, is there anything here that can help us out? Maybe. Wait a second. If she did recreate this room exactly, which it looks like she did, then I have this. What is it? It's my music box. I'm thinking maybe I can take a couple of gears from inside and fashion them into a lockpick. Maybe I can. Can you hold this? Mm -hmm. <gasps> Emma, you did it! You unlocked the door! <laughs> Come on, let's go. Okay. How is your tea, my friends? Well, there's nothing in these, so not good. Chloe, we have to play along. Mmm, so tasty, Miss Moffat. Why, thank you. You're welcome. Play-Doh cookie? Oh, no thanks. We are super Full. Yep. Okay then, more for me. Tell me a story. A story? Okay, once upon a time there was a weird little girl who tried to turn all the Super Pops into her pretend friends. Cosmic, no, uh, the story goes, there was a kind and beautiful sweet little girl who kindly changed her friends back into normal sized people so that way they could be friends with her in real life. So thoughtful. If you're talking about me, that's not gonna happen. Ugh, why not? Because my sister wouldn't like it. And because you might leave me and not be my friends anymore. You can't force someone to be your friend, Miss Muffet. Yes, I can. You two are going to stay and we're gonna be friends forever. Now, I gotta go eat dinner, but when I get back, I'll see you again and we can play some more. Great. Wonderful. Ugh, this is worse than flying in the backseat of a plane. Here you go, Chloe. I hope this helps you. Wait, so you guys got out? We did, and now we're in this, like, pink theater? I don't know. We had to pick the lock to get out of our dorm room. Do you see anything you can use to pick a lock? Not really. There's just books on books on books. Wait a second. Have you guys heard of that rumor that there's a secret passageway through the library? I've heard that, but i never known it's true. Wait, look at this. The history of Baywood. There's maps and everything. Okay, wait, we have to look at a map of the library. Here it is. Wait, that doesn't make sense. There's a gap between two of the bookshelves, but there isn't one there now. Maybe it's hidden? It says, to access the door you'll see, the words will be the key times three. Words will be the key. <gasps> maybe one of the books is a lever. You know, like in movies, I've seen it plenty of times. You never know, maybe just pull a bunch of books off the shelves and see if one of them works. Okay, let's do this. I don't know what's worse, being stuck in this classroom or being stuck out there at our tea party. Yes, we've got to find a way out and, and maybe find something to unlock the door, a key of some sort. You don't think she'd leave a key in here, do you? It's worth looking. Come on. Okay. It's been none of these books so far. And there are still so many books left. Oh. <gasps> Maybe it's not a book. Words will be the key. Maybe it's a, a, a phrase or, or a spell. Wait, she does have the same favorite book as Electra, Wizard of Oz. Yes, and times three. Maybe it's a phrase like, There's no place like home. There's, There's no place like home. There's, There's no place like home. <gasps> we did it! Let's go! Come on. Oh, 
This is impossible. There's nothing in any of these desks. Cosmic, Majesty, are you there? Come in. Yeah, we're still here, unfortunately. Stuck in this classroom. We were all about to get out of our rooms by picking the locks or using secret passageways. Do you see any secret passageways? Nope, just desks and misery. <gasps> Wait a second, Cosmic. Wait, what? How is this possible? I don't know. Dr. Kittens took it from me. But do you think it's like a trap? Do you think it's like a bad one? Well, there's a note and it says, from Cosmic Pop Secret Admirer. Oh! Wait, what? I have an admirer? Wait, I mean, who could it be? Okay, I'm blushing. Who would have been able to get this wand from Dr. Kittens? Well, we can worry about that later. Let's see if this works and restores us to normal size. Here we go. Anything? Nothing. It seems our powers are much weaker here in Miss Muppet's house. Uh, maybe you can at least try to unlock the door? All right, here goes. Mm, come on. Okay, Majesty. Come on, let's go. Okay. You guys did it. Great job. We all may be stuck here, but at least we're stronger together. What? We have to figure out how to escape. There's got to be a way. Maybe we should all try our powers again. How did you guys get out of your rooms? <gasps> Bad friends. You need a time out. Wait, little Miss Muffet, please. We, we were just... We really want to hang out with you. <laughs> yeah! Why don't you make us normal size so we can all hang out? But then you'll leave me. Friends don't stay together 100% of the time, but that's what makes a good friend. They always come back. What are your hobbies, Miss Muppet? Yeah, like, what do you like to do? Well, I like to sing. Singing? That's it, ladies. Your voices are your most powerful asset. You must sing. Do you want to hear a song? Okay. Good luck, ladies. Sing your hearts out. You can't always get your way forever. That's no way to treat a friend. We gotta listen to each other find a way to work together that'll be far the best in the end you can change everything choose to sing and help set us free friends. We can be your real friends. If you just let us out of here. Please. please. Well. Okay. If you guys promise to come back 
and don't tell my sister. Of course. Wait a second, if you created all of these rooms, then you must know who we really are. Can we trust you as our friend to keep this a secret? Of course. Your secret is safe with me. Friends. <laughs> Bye! <sighs> oh, I can't believe she let us out. I feel bad for her. I know, and having misfortune as your sister, I mean, yikes. She must be so lonely. We have to be true to our word and come back to see her. But for now, ladies, we need to get back to my spaceship before the bunglers realize we're gone. Now, where's my wand? Oh, yes, there it is. Let's go. Super Pops, we can't be stopped! Miss Muffet, you are spectacular! I can't believe how you handled those Super Pops. I'm just so proud! Now, where are they? I let them go. What? what? No! Why would you do that? Because they were nice and are my friends. I should have known a child couldn't be trusted with this. Especially someone from Miss Fortune's family. <sighs> hey! I resent that! Ah, uh, back to the drawing board. To the lair. They did it. They got away. What was that, Spike? Uh, nothing. We have to get those super pops. Yes, and now that we all have new powers, we're stronger than ever. Oh, super pops, you will be stopped by Dr. Ruin. <laughs> <laughs>